perfect. The game went pretty well, doubled the score. OK, nothing to really be mad out, mad at. And really, as we look out into the city, we're looking at a beautiful night. So if you're going to be staying out, celebrate and have a little bit of a late one, definitely not a bad idea. And you're going to continue to have some pretty nice conditions to do so. Now, quick look back. It was a very warm day. We saw temperatures get up to 86 degrees. Those are averages that we would see at the end of August, beginning of September, not the last day of September. So definitely a warmer one, but we're cooling off right now. 69 degrees in the city of Knoxville, seeing as cool as 61 degrees in La Follette. Then on the flip side, 62 degrees in Telco Plains. So it is starting to really cool down as we get into some of those higher elevations and places a bit further north. But nothing to really see on the satellite radar. We did kind of have some scattered rain or scattered cloud cover that was moving through the area that really is continuing to fade as we get through the rest of the night. The game is over, and so now as we get into the nighttime hours, temperatures are going to continue to fall down into the lower 60s by the time we get into the morning. Lows generally going to be in the upper 50s to lower 60s. So we're seeing those upper 50s as we get into the higher elevations. Something I should also make you aware of is that there is going to be the possibility of some patchy dense fog moving through much of the area. So if you're going to be leaving the house early, heading to church, anything like that, it is something to keep in mind before you hit the roads. But your Sunday as a whole going to be a beautiful day. We'll see temperatures in the upper 70s by noon, mid 80s for those highs. It's going to be a nice, sunny, pretty calm day with a light little breeze too, Vinay. Nothing to be mad about.